It was a nine game Saturday highlighted by several buzzer beaters. We'll get to those throughout our daily top 10. We begin in New Orleans, where the easiest way to the bucket sometimes requires a reverse course. First Jared Jack, then Carl Landry. Hornets lose by three, but hey, they did it in style. Great move by Jack and Landry. 14 points off the bench for J.R. Smith. Happy birthday, coach. Mike Woodson's gotta love this. J.R. Smith breaking down the defense and scoring. At play number eight, Tim Milwaukee, where Indiana was in town. Roy Hibbert, no. Paul George, yes. George just two of five, but Indiana won this one by 21. At play number seven, Louis Scola to Chandler Parsons. Great feed by Scola on what was a clutch night from Parsons. Air Canada invades Chicago. Jose Calderon up top, Amir Johnson putting it down. Much more to come from this game. Halfway through the countdown, you know we gotta check in with BG. Blake Griffin, spinning his way to a reverse slam. The Clippers streak is over. Blake had 20 and 10. At play number four, Bucks lost big. But Brandon Jennings providing some highlights from well beyond half court. You betcha. Jennings getting it out of his hand at the last possible second and drilling it. At play number three, back to J.R. Smith, where he finds Yvonne Shumpert. Back to J.R. Smith. A double alley-oop from the Knickerbockers, who haven't lost back-to-back -back games in the Mike Woodson era. Spinning and winning. Nick Young with a little spin cycle action. Two of his 16 points off the bench in the Clippers win. And our top play from Saturday. Bulls trailing by one at overtime. Final second, C.J. Watson misses. Luau Dang, right place, right time. And that's how the Bulls clinch a spot in the Eastern Conference playoffs. W number 40, Dang ends it, getting it done for Chicago. And now we're done. That's your top 10 from Saturday.